Hey guys, thanks so much for coming to the channel. That little intro musical piece I did is a brand new song I'm producing and writing for a kids TV show I'm working on. And in the, in the TV world, you gotta be quick, you gotta be fast, you gotta be efficient. So what I wanna do in this little series is document the songwriting process and how that's done. So let's check it out. All right, now there's no right or wrong way to songwriting. I think, of course, the more you practice it, the better you get at it. You know, you take all the knowledge you've gathered and then you apply it into what's gonna be your songwriting process. So what I like to do is I always start with my chord wheel and I'll put this guy right here. Hopefully that's in focus. And what I do is I spin it, you spin this little wheel and then I pick a key. So in this song, for example, I pick the key of D. So in the key of D, if you look at this, you see that little highlighted part? The black, well, the black highlight outlines all the chords that are contained with the key signature that you're playing in. So for me, I'm in the key of D, all right? So I'm in the key of D, and what I did is I started thinking, okay, let me look at what's in the key of D. So the one chord is obviously D, right? Two chord is E minor, then we've got the three chord F sharp minor, we've got the four chord, which is G, and then we've got the five chord A, a relative minor is B minor, which is a six chord. So I kept it real simple, because like I said, I needed to get an idea up and running fast. So what I do, my tool of trade is my guitar. So I take my guitar, the DAW I'm using is Logic, Pro Tools, Logic, whatever you're using. Sometimes I start without it, but I like to get a drum beat going because I like to play and be inspired, and that ultimately determines the vibe of the track I'm gonna write. And just for fun, what I did is I'm playing, I got this new tube head. It is a 420 watt head by Rev. And it's amazing because it has all the cool new technology built right into it and it still gives me the sound and flavor I want. And I'm you know, using some pedals in my pedal board. I think in this song, in that example, I used Earthquaker Device's gray channel and then I just ran it through the rev straight into Logic. So I got an, an idea up and running really quick. So the guitar, through my pedal board, through the rev head, into Logic, I'm using Superior Drummer. I love working with real drummers, but unfortunately in this day and age, due to time, real drummers in my experience, have, no offense drummers, I love you guys all, but have been flaky. Uh, a lot of them can't play unless they play to a click track. So that can become a problem too, especially if you want to cut something in the studio without one. Of course, in this song, I'm playing Superior Drummer, so it's locked into the tempo of 120, but that's fine. So what we're going to do is we're going to document this whole journey of the song, and I want you to see the whole process from where it's, a, it's nothing, there's no idea there, and how that goes from something to a finished product that consumers hear. All right, and what I'm doing too is I'm going to... Um, take my notebook. So I'm going to take this notebook and I just start filling up the page with lyrical ideas. I don't sit and try and write set lyrics. I just let information flow out of my head onto the page. And I take that, I break it down, and you'll see how I apply it. I really don't even have any idea what the song's going to be about yet, but we're going to see. All right? So let's see what happens. All right, guys, thank you so much for checking out this video. This is the very first video that I've done of this kind of series. And for me, this is great, too, because I got a whole bunch of new gear here that I'm trying to figure out. So I've got a brand new Canon M50. I've got new lighting. Uh, in this case, I'm kind of lucky. I got my little setup within my classroom, and I get to use some natural lighting. I've got my new Rev. I, got, I just built my pedal board, so I'm trying to put it all together for you. So... If you have any comments or questions, put them down below. Maybe you have ideas for the song. That's why it's gonna be kind of fun. I wanna build a community of lifelong learners on here, people that play instruments. And you know, the whole goal of the TV show, it's about these kids in a rock band, right? And it's a cartoon, and the whole goal of the show is to create more creators like you, the people that are watching this video. And if I can do anything in my power to help facilitate that process, that's what I'm gonna do. So hit the subscribe button because I want you to see when new videos come out and it's gonna be super fun to see where this song goes. I have no idea, so let's do it and find out and see what instrumentation it uses and you know, check it out once the show hits the air and you'll, you'll see the song and see the whole process documented here. So like I tell everybody, as always, go out, create, be amazing, peace.